Hello and welcome to this session of Sunday special. Today I am going to discuss with you something very important and something which uh, normally people do not discuss or tell you. It is about uh, going out of your comfort zone. Now this is not exactly the topic and this is something very common. You must have seen a lot of videos, a lot of people might have told you that you have to go out of your comfort zone if you have to achieve anything and all the things that you want or desire lies outside your comfort zone so it is very important to move out of your comfort zone first let us understand what exactly is a comfort zone so for you a comfort zone will be uh, as of today whatever your daily routine is or whatever you are you have been doing since a long time like getting up at some particular time and then uh, getting ready for maybe work or uh, college and then doing the normal stuff there coming back eating and you know enjoying some time and then sleeping so this can be your comfort zone as of now now how do you uh, reach or how do you go out of your comfort zone let us say you want to achieve something and for that you will have to uh, spend some extra time or do some extra work which you have not been doing for a long time or you have you are not used to it and then only after you do that you will be able to get things which lies out of your comfort zone now before I actually tell you the procedure and what exactly is missing in what we normally know let me tell you that we have we always have some norms so your daily routine today is your current norm let us take an example suppose you live in a single room home and with very limited features with very limited facilities but you have been living there for few years that becomes your norm and you are okay with that now suppose you get a bigger house and it has more rooms it has more features more uh, facilities then you will know that okay the earlier home had so many limitations and this is better and then you start living in that bigger house after some time that becomes your new norm again if you move to a bigger house you will realize that the older house was still uh, had so many limitations and now it is much better it uh, the new houses has so many features so many facilities and you start living there and that becomes your new norm and always there are uh, options further than that you will always find a bigger home anytime in your life so this is how we we uh, make our norms so as of now currently whatever you are doing has become your norm and that has become your comfort zone now when you try to come out of your comfort zone or when you try to achieve things that lie out of your comfort zone you have to first go into the stretch zone and this is what uh, nobody speaks about the stretch zone so what is this is whenever you are trying to move out of your norm or whenever you are trying to make any changes in your daily activities daily routine or whatever you have been doing for a long time you have to stretch and you have to do it in a very uh, ideological or methodological way and that is that you have to start with very simple steps let me give you an example suppose you are waking up at 7 a.m and you want to wake up at 5 a.m now if you uh, get an if you set an alarm for 5 a.m tomorrow it's not like you are going to wake up at 5 a.m and it's not gonna work so you have to do it in steps you may wake up for one or two days because you are so much motivated and you have you know promised yourself and all those things but then let me tell you the third day you are not going to do that because uh, your mind will not allow it and therefore we have to do it in steps for example if you are waking up at 7 a.m for the next day set up an alarm for 6 50 a.m and then stay on that alarm for at least few days so that it becomes your new norm and then again uh, set an alarm for 6 40 a.m and be there for few days so it becomes your new norm and similarly keep on stretching yourself step by step and this is very important that you do it step by step in very small steps so that the new norm that you are going to or, or that you want to achieve that is waking up at 5 a.m does not becomes very difficult and you are able to achieve it and then it will easily become your new norm so this is very important the second thing is going back again and again if you fail trying at any of the step for example 
if you uh, if you have reached until 6 a.m and then the next day you have set up an alarm for 5 50 a.m and due to any xyz reasons you missed it then you have to go back and you have to go back again and again until you get it the reason is if you keep on going back um, no matter how difficult that thing is the example i'm taking is may not be so difficult but i know it is difficult for many people so if you keep on going back again and again to that thing your brain will say that you know this guy is not gonna give up so we have to adjust i have to adjust and i have to make it possible so it is how you will make things possible and you go in small steps and go back again and again if you are not able to go uh, get into any of the step and this is how after a few days you will uh, cover this stretch zone and you will come into a new zone which is outside your earlier comfort zone or your earlier norm and then you remain in this new zone for some times it becomes your new norm and it will be very easy to stay in this new comfort zone or your new norm and then you can again plan for a new achievement or a, or something new which lies even out of your new comfort zone and this is how you achieve things i hope you have got what i am i have tried to say here and uh, i will meet you in the next episode of sunday special thank you for watching